I see you've had such a varied journey from theater to RJ to TV host to sports host to poet to musician, you know, to acting. So tell me, did this all evolve? Was it a part of your goal or did you have a goal and these were all milestones? I mean, people generally don't have such a varied and rich journey. And you can't reach anywhere if you, until, unless you don't have a goal. Hmm, hmm. So I always wanted to be an actor. Okay. Or a star, hmm, like hmm. a bankable actor. Let's put ha. it like that. <laughs> like a bankable actor. Yes, hmm, hmm. but these were all stepping stones, and I always had to make a choice between music and theater hmm, and sports hmm. in school. Hmm, hmm. And I always chose uh, theater over anything else. I think it's a very wholesome exercise. It included your physicality, also your music, musicality, also hmm, everything hmm. was there. Hmm. So that's why I call theater a very wholesome ex exercise. I think for us, it was like an army training. I was in all boys school, all boys college, and I remember there was this all girls school right next to our college. Hmm, hmm. But we were just so focused, and there's a thing called Gary Route in Chandigarh. Hmm, hmm. So in Gary Route, you you just you do do nothing just <laughs> on your bikes and cars. You just uh, you know take rounds, hmm. and you know girls and guys is just ch chatting and faffing and hmm. having fun. That's a Punjab and thing. I never did that in college. I was just in that auditorium hmm. and focusing on my craft. And we were just making plays, doing theater and winning awards across the nation. A uh, bunch of 10 boys, absolutely driven. So I got disciplined from theater. Wow.